my name's Diane Roach, and I'm a religious of the Sacred Heart uh, since 1974. Um, and it was in the late 70s when I was in the end of my college career, and I was beginning to wonder what I would do with my life, uh, that I really opened that question up to God and said, if you care, you know what smatterings of talents I have and you know my weaknesses, give me the perfect job. And he did. Through the help of these Carmelite nuns in Roxbury, uh, they prayed for me and two weeks later I walk into an office of a Monsignor in New Hampshire who says, I'd be glad to sign your applications for teacher corps, but I have a job that would be perfect for you. And in fact, it was. And that led me to my love of low-income housing and building of community. And that indirectly led me back to Roxbury, where I had bumped into Carol Putnam, doing similar work in what they call the tot lot. Um, and it was such a good fit. Uh, I never had a chance to live with Carol, but the example of her creativity, of her joy, of the swirling energy and hope and delight of the people who came in and out of that house excited me and um, made me sense that this group of women would be able to form community anywhere and that wherever they formed community, they would be making a difference in the lives of the people around them. So it was just that little seed of seeing what she was doing in the South End with all those other RSDJ, and, um, and then a, a sense of confirmation every time I met from that point on with RSCJ as part of the exploration process. They were so normal, they were so funny, and I could see myself feeling very much at home among them. And honestly, that feeling has continued to this day.